I wonder if it stopped because of that. That's interesting. Okay, so we're back on. Wonder if this is gonna make it into the 19th. Welcome back, everybody. Okay, guys, I'm counting on you. It's bad time for it to Fire split up too. I don't know, swears. <laughs> Here we go. With exact, precise aim. Hits right into it. Mustn't get up. What was that cry? Martell, I would assume. The out of control great seed is Martell herself. I wonder. The great seed is once again bound in the holy ground of Carlot. For that, I owe you my gratitude. Thank you. It seems that you have managed to save the Great Seed as well as this world. If the Great Seed is intact, then I presume Martell, who's fused with it, is safe as well? I'm sure that's good news for you. I wish I could say the same for me. <laughs> Colette, it looks like things have settled down. It's gross, isn't it? Disgusting, isn't it? It's... It, it's... It's not at all. Stay away! Don't look at me! Colette! It's okay, she just fainted. Let's take her back to the village. To Isalia? But Lloyd and I were banished. Colette's home is in Isalia. Besides, we can't just leave behind the people who were held at the ranch. All right. Let's go to Asalia. And I'll notify Sheena to meet you at Asalia. Farewell for now. Oh. He's gonna tell me to put the disc in. I see. So the angels of Crucius were really half elves. <laughs> Please don't tell anyone about this. We don't want to start a panic. Indeed. Especially now that the Tower of Salvation is gone. I wouldn't dare tell people the truth. Tower of Salvation is gone? After that frightening earthquake, the tower disappeared from the eastern sky. 
along with that monstrosity. How could it disappear? I don't know. The Chosen never completed the ritual of regeneration. The Crucius core system, which controls the appearance of the tower, may have malfunctioned. It is of little consequence. No, it's not. It's a tremendous shock to the people of Silverhunt. After a giant earthquake sunders the land, the symbol of salvation vanishes. The Chosen will be held responsible. Why? Lots of other Chosen have failed up till now, too. The others have paid for their failure with their lives, but Colette is still alive. When people are suffering, they feel the need to place the blame on someone. It is not fair to Colette. I'm gonna go see what's going on in the village. I'll go too. I'm confused here. Okay, we went all through that chaos of, you know, the Carlon, you know, basically the trees, um, became a monster. But what happened to the splitting of the worlds? Wouldn't that have happened in this whole thing after the whole tree went kaboomy? Let's all go together then. Sounds like it's a bit sketchy for you to be walking around by yourself. I'll stay here. Go on. I didn't see my man. Come back. Come back, man. Don't leave me. Is there a save point somewhere? Sheesh. I'm gonna need to understand. You're still a child, it seems. <laughs> I'm growing up too. Uh, oh, you're an adult, okay, genius. We can call you that. <laughs> hey, you're treating me like a kid again. It's not like you're any older than I am. <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> Uh, how old is she really, is the question. I thought they couldn't come back to the city. I'm very confused. This is an outrage. Those who were banished are turning without permission? See, there we go. The Chosen failed atro atrociously. It's the end of the world. Well, he certainly hasn't changed. And on top of all that, people who thought were elves are actually half-elves? I bet you were the ones that led the designs here to attack this village. What did you say? Here, he's only a child. It doesn't matter if he's a child, he's a half-elf! I've heard enough from you! Now listen! It's true that the Professor and Genus are half-elves, but so what? They are good half-elves, just as they are. there are bad half-elves. Uh, hmm. What does a kid know? You were raised by a dwarf. It's no wonder you caused the Chosen to fail our journey. And you even brought a bunch of dirty prisoners back here. It's intolerable how much pain you've caused the good humans of this village. What? That's enough! You're just complaining about everything. Does any part of you besides your mouth even work? Shut up. Yeah, you tell him. I've had all I can handle of this chump. You criticize and attack people for their birth and upbringing, things they cannot change. It is you who are not human. What? We have an arrangement with the designs. I have a duty to protect this village, isn't that right? Say something. Jesus is the smartest person in this village. He even knows factorizations that you don't know. The professor is scary when she is angry, but when I know the answer, he's happy too. Lloyd isn't any good at school, but he's the strongest in the village. He saved me when I was attacked by monsters. Colette, she always falling down and stuff, but she never cries. She doesn't cry even when it hurts. Colette is really grown up. Everyone. Ray, shut up. You children go away. Those children understand the truth much better than you. Who do you think you are? And it's not just you. Everyone shoved all the responsibility on the Chosen and Lloyd and the others. What have you done? You haven't done anything. We are powerless, yes, but even powerless, we can still aid the Chosen and our companions when they return exhausted to their village, to this village. Mayor, your words are so shallow that even a child can see through them. You say that you are powerless and force everything onto the Chosen, 
But when push comes to shove, you turn the blame to her. Oh, sorry, I blame her. That's just too much. For Cecis is dead. There are no more restrictions upon this village. We will take in the Chosen and her companions and the people from the ranch. The mayor, we're not going to let you say a word about it. Yet. Yeah. Everyone, are you sure? I'm a half elf, remember? But you were raised in this village, and Lloyd is like a member of this village too. Thank you, everyone. Fine. Do what you want. I must apologize to you. What? You saved me, and yet I... I couldn't bring myself to accept it. I heard at the ranch about how you were kind to Grandma. Thank you. Thank you, Charlotte. It's always, I'll always remember Marble for the rest of my life. She became a Marble. <laughs> it's not it. Reality is an ex-fear, but still. I am so tired right now. Okay. So basically, this is it for today on my stream for Tales of Symphonia. Wow, I only have... Oh, I gotta go get rain. Let me go get rain real quick. I'm gonna forget. Now I gotta leave this little live on there all. Sorry, it's a village, but... Eep. Professor, what is it? No, it's nothing. It's just... No, no. Never mind. Hmm? Perhaps this village has some help left for it after all. I was really looking forward to you chewing out the mayor. I'm not stupid enough to waste my time lecturing pigs. Well, well, my apologies. Okay, so she's back in our group. So we go save again. And that's basically it for today. But thank you so much for um, watching the stream. And I hope it helped. If you're, you know, doing the game yourself and trying to figure this game out. Have a great rest of the day.